guys, as you might see, I got a new hair color. I did on uh, dark brown. Uh, I, I was sick of the blonde. I, I, it was semi-blonde. I wasn't really blonde. But my hair is literally dead after dying at so many colors. So I'm, I'm just not going to mess with it. So I'm just going to leave it with one color and keep it moving from that color. <laughs> and then treat it because my hair is like literally dead. It's like hard as a mop. I can mop the floor with my hair. So, whatever. Well, I wanted to do a little haul video for you guys. I've been shopping quite a lot this few past weeks. So, um, I got everything ready so I could show you. Ooh, I got some things from H&M, Forever 21, Five and Below, Target. So, let's get started. All right. All right. The first thing I got from Forever Twenty One is this crop top with this skirt. This black and gray. Um. There you go. It's a sheer material. This material is more in the thick side, and this one is more like soft. So I really liked it to put together. You know. This in the top and this in the bottom. I think it would look very pretty with some heels or even flats or anything that you want to wear with. With, but I really like this one. You know me, uh, liking that so much. I had to get the long sleeve crop top, black and white, and the same thing, a pencil little skirt that looks like this. I also got. This other crop top that is blue with uh, little flowers to pair it with jeans and like some boots, something just to go casually out. You could dress it up or down, whatever you decide. Another thing I picked up was this sweater that says love at the bottom. I really, really like sweaters for the winter. Over here in New York, it's kind of still a little cold, so I would I love this just to wear with this with some jeans, with some sneakers or heels, and just dress it up or dress it down. You could really go both ways with this one. I also got this crop top. I don't know if you guys can see. It's like a little sweater from Friday 21. I would decide to wear it today, so couldn't show it to you guys but I'm showing it to you guys wearing it so whatever keep going the last thing I got from forever 21 is this headband cheetah print kind of styled um uh, I decided to buy this in case I just didn't want to do my hair and it was one one of those lazy days so that could also work Another store that I went to was Five and Below. It's a store in my area about where I live. And I always get my nail polishes from there. Oh, most of my nail polishes are from there because they have such pretty colors. And one of the colors that I'm wearing is right now. It's from there. The color that I am wearing is Divine. So it's a very nice... Uh, Purple, purple you could say, violet kind of color. The second color I got was this mint green. And it's honey boo, honey, yeah honey boo color. Very pretty color. This other one I have is Let the Games Begin. Weird name, but very pretty. This color, I don't know if you can see it, is more of a, what color would it be? It's a blue, go, like dark blue. It seems light in the camera. I don't know why it's showing like that. But it's like a dark blue, almost green kind of color. This one, it's jellyfish color name of it jellyfish and the color is blue 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 the color is a little 
more vibrant in the camera than in person, but it's a very nice color in as well. Another store. Okay, another store that I went to was H and M's. Love H and M's. They just closed down the one near me, so I have to go literally like an hour away for a store that was here like two seconds ago. It's just very annoying. So the first thing I got in Forever 21, I only got two things, so let's let's not even say the first thing. Well, I got this little card again. It's a, it's a light kind of blue, so it's very blue purple as you can call it. It's a very nice cardigan to wear with like a shirt underneath when it's kind of cold in the in the summer, not in the winter, because there's too many holes in here and you're gonna be freezing. Like I like that color so much and I like the style of the cardigan. I got it in black too. So here it is. Same thing. Next to H&M's, there is a store called Charming Charlie's. I hope people have that around you guys. I don't know. But they also have a website. But it tells you where each store is located. So you guys can check that out. First thing I got was these glasses with a metal kind of looking um, chain in the side of the glasses. But they're um, brown. They look very nice indeed. I like, I mean, I'm not a fan of glasses because I feel like I'm going to break every single one of them. But that was cool. Another thing I got is this gray necklace. I love big, chunky necklace. Oh my god, there's. Sorry guys, but you know my little doggy. Well, I love big statement necklace. I think it goes great with any outfit, even with the outfit that the, the sweater that I got from Forever to New I'm the love. I will totally pair it up together. Another necklace I got. If I can get this off, is this circ. Oh, another necklace that I got is this purple kind of turquoise um, necklace. It's like little circles everywhere in a big circle in the middle. I love the color. I don't know why is the color showing up blue in the camera, but it's very purple to say the least. So that's this. Pick up one of this kind of funky kind of looking necklace. It's one of those old necklaces that you would see. So it's like kind of nah tribe looking, you could say. It's orange and it has two little circles right here. And it's big. I mean, it's huge. So... I wanted to try it out. I mean, there's, I wouldn't, I don't know if I would have literally got this if my cousin wouldn't have pushed me to it. But I like it now, so you know. I'll see if I like it with any other clothes. Try it out. Let's see how it goes. I also went to Target. I went in for one thing. I actually went to get nail polish, but I came out with makeup, so whatever. <laughs> So, I got the Sally Hansen um, nail polish remover. I just wanted to get just something normal so I could just take the color off my nails. I got the Maybelline New York Shine Free Matte Finish Powder in medium, a golden medium too. It looks like this. 
It has a little sponge in the middle. I haven't opened it because I haven't been there for who knows how long since I got it. So it's just a very sheer. It doesn't have that much color. It looks a little in the white side. But just don't overdo it. So that's kind of good. Well, this sponge I would not be using. That's for sure. So my sister was telling me that Neutrogena uh, lip balm was really good. So I wanted to try it out. and Because in winter, my lips get so chopped up. Is that a word? I just made up my own word. Whatever. They're very flaky. Like, like it hurts at times because they're so dry. So I try to get as many lip balms as I can and try them all. But none of them really have worked for me. Like to keep them moist all day. So I wanted to try this one. This one is in sheer tint. So it really doesn't have a tint to it. Because it's a lip balm. So let's see how it works. Let's see if it works for my lips. But it smells kind of good. It has this medicine kind of smell to it. I don't even know how to describe it. I'll go with medicine. Yeah, medicine kind of smell to it. I also got the Fit Me 315 um, powder. I wanted to try a new powder. But I think I got it way too light. But in winter, I'm very light. You know, I try to tan. Well, set tan anyways. But I haven't done it in a very long time. So let's see if this works. Because I'm not planning to tan anytime soon. So let's see if this works and doesn't make me all white. More white than what I am. Well, that's it with this. One of my favorite things that I got um, this month would be this um, BH Cosmetics uh, brushes. They are like a dupe for like Sigma with the little case and everything. I love Sigma brushes, but at times they could be on the more high and expensive um, brushes. So, not a lot of people have money to get those. I do have those, but, you know, I try to do with more affordable things to show people. So, it comes with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, nine brushes. Oh, there's many... Whoa, whoa. There's many brushes. Something I love is the colors of each one. I love the fact that it has a different color for each one. So like this foundation brush has like a orange one, like curl. This one has like a blue. And this one has like a yellow, lemony kind of color. Like light purple. I love each found like all the brushes that it comes with and plus the color it can't be any better. I love color combination. One of the downsides of the brushes is the fact that it really doesn't tell you like what is each brush for and like you have to look on the like website and you gotta check it out which foundation like what which brush goes into whatever category that you want to but besides that they're very soft very soft so they're very good and I don't think they weren't a lot. I think I bought them for like 25 because they were on sale. I might be wrong, but I will leave the link below and let me know if you guys like them or not. Well, I think that is it guys. Well, I hope you enjoy the video and if you have any requests, any looks that you want to see, anything that I just mentioned that you want a tutorial on or my comments about them after using them just leave them in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe